Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to one and all present over here. Happiness is spiritual, born of truth and love. It is unselfish. Therefore, it cannot exist alone, but requires all mankind to share it, said Mary Baker Eddy. With this beautiful thought, I, Alicia Alamdar, welcome you all to our Human Happiness Hour presented by Life Skills Studio under the precious guidance of our project head, Mr. Pramod Thubay. During this unprecedented time of COVID-19, Life Skill Studio came up with this amazing project, Human Happiness, in order to train participants to share happiness. Being happy is beneficial for the person as well as society. When children are happy, they become future global citizens who will strive to achieve the sustainable development goals. Happiness ambassadors and facilitators from across the globe joined this project and today all have gathered together for the culminating event, Human Happiness Hours. I welcome you all. And to add more spark to our event, today we have a very special guest. I feel privileged to welcome our today's guest of honor, Madam Paramjeet Kaur Dhilon, Principal Kamla Nehru Public School, Agwara, Punjab, India. She is a resource person for CBSC New Delhi, British Council Validated Master Trainer and Microsoft Innovative Educator Master Trainer and has trained 1000 plus educators all over India. She has mapped the entire school K2 curriculum with United Nations 17 Sustainable Development Goals and initiated the friendly AI project. She has a rich 26 years of experience in the field of education. She has a vision that every teacher qualifies to be an MIE expert. She's the only principal to represent India and participate in the Microsoft Educator Exchange <coughs> Program held at Canada in March 2017. Her innovative ideas towards achieving SDGs 2030 are inspiring educators, not only from India, but across the globe. Indeed, it's our pleasure to have Madam Paramjeet Kaur with us today. <coughs> with your due permission, I would like to proceed with the further presentations. But before that, let me tell the sequence as we, um, the first two presenters are not with us. They have not joined yet. So we'll move mm -hmm. ahead with the third presentation from- Sorry to interrupt you, Arifia ma'am. Uh, first yeah. presenter, she has joined. Okay, okay, yeah. So I request the students of SK Batubalai, Malaysia to proceed with their presentation. Okay, uh, so Ms. Kabatubale will be presenting Kaira, Vikran, Ati, Vikran, and Haura. I'm still waiting for one of my presenter. Sorry to interrupt. Um, Excuse me, Pramod sir. Shall mm -hmm. we wait for the presenter to join? Uh, Sumaya, uh, Madam Sumaya, yeah. has she she's saying that uh, the presenter will join soon. Is she saying yeah. that? Yeah, I'm still waiting for one of my presenter. Okay then. Uh, Alifia, ma'am, we'll uh, move to, uh, towards the next one. Okay. So. We'll move ahead with the third, second presentation by student of Prabhatkir School, 
and a student from Podar International School, Deed. I would also like to uh, inform all the students to please turn on your camera before giving your presentation. Rest of the students can switch their mic off, be on mute when the students are presenting. Right and shine. Heartfelt welcome to today's Human Happiness Overview Meeting. Hola everyone, this is Khush Sanjati, a grade 10 student from Poda International School, be it Maharashtra with my colleague. Sorry. Uh, just a second. Just a second, Batul and Khushi, just a second. Uh, sorry to interrupt Pramod sir, I have to start the presentation. Uh, but I am not the host over here. But you can share the... I already okay. make it multiple participants to share the screen. You can share the screen. Yeah. Is my screen visible? Still loading. Maybe facing some network issues, sir. Um, I'm stop sharing. I'll share. Yeah. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes, sir. Okay, please go on. Yeah, okay. okay, guys and shine heartfelt welcome to today's human happiness. Today's human happiness overview meeting. I'm I'm Kushi Sanjati, a grade 10 student from Puda International School, Bid, Bid Maharashtra, here with my colleague. Batul Alamdar, grade 10 student from Prabhat Kids, Prabhat Kids School, Akela. It's an immense pleasure to be here with all of you. I hope you all enjoy this meeting. Let's take a quick recap and overview of the amazing activities that we had in this journey of human happiness. So this was the global project which I gave to you from one of my friends and wanted to be a part of it. Without, without bothering about restriction of school or anything, I took part in it. Moving ahead, human happiness, the journey with I is experienced with a lot of memorable activity. The thing which we conducted on this long journey were fascinating and splendid. At the beginning, we, con we introduced ourselves on, on Flipgrid and Vekleta with uh, uh, Vekleta and, and Flipgrid app with lots of emoji with emojis filter with emojis filter emojis oh, with emojis and filter. Next thing which we done was regular integrated activity. Sharing a happiest moment, my mother in action. Sharing a happiest moment, my mother in action and my ID. Ambassador created the collection with lots of classy fonts, lots of classy fonts, background images, background images. The feeling which we had was tremendously pleasant. The next phase was the, culture, was the cultural and educational exchange where we got to know about each other and built a global connection. This was one of our favorite uh, phases. Global edu globally, educators, facilitators, and ambassadors collaborated together on online platforms like Zoom, Google Meet, Microsoft Teams, etc. to get to know about each other. Some even shared their stats of education. Here's a glimpse. 
our our uh, facilitator Alifia Alamdar ma'am and the students collaborated together with a facilitator from Russia Nadezda ma'am this not only helped us build a global collection connection but also helped us build collaboration and get to know about each other country, each other's con uh, countries heritage culture and uh, educational curriculum final phase that was art integrated learning was our most favorite the activity which was origami heart was the one that we loved the most the guide teacher kalyani ma'am guided us to make these origami hearts in which we shared that feelings which we have in our heart and how we made others happy now let us take a quick uh, overview about how and what impacts did we have from this amazing project at first we developed the four seeds the four seeds are namely communication collaboration critical thinking and creativity these skills are proven to be improved and developed through pbl activities let us know more about it explore pbl activity pbl means project bus and in simple language pbl is not just the project it is something that allows us to think out of the box it includes personal and social responsibility planning creativity strong communication skill cross culture understanding visualizing and decision making we were doing art art integrated activity ambassador created origami heart to share the feeling and the ethical quality when we analyze it it will satisfy in case one something negative thing have had happened with us we should learn take it ahead rather than we should learn from it and take it as a positive aspect this is what we learned from the project and finally we also imbibed the values and life skills and got to know about a lot of technology we got to know tech tools like wakelet flipgrid microsoft teams etc and we imbibed values and life skills like happiness gratefulness and many more and finally i would like to give credits to slides mania for this amazing presentation template and our guide teacher and facilitator alicia Okay, uh, thank you so much, Batul, uh, yeah. for this lovely presentation. Um, I think okay, uh, she's here. Yeah. What do you are? Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, students, for your amazing presentation. Moving ahead further, we have educator Corina Suchdeya, ma'am, from Romania. I request you, ma'am, to proceed with your presentation. Corina, are you there? Because now we are, uh, as we are moving forward, uh, to we have skipped to presentations. Her turn yet is yet to come. So, uh, Madam Sumaya, I request your students to who are the present there, uh, please uh, move forward with your students. Unmute yourself. I'm still waiting for one more student. I guess, ma'am, uh, could you please move, uh, move ahead with uh, whoever is there present because, uh, you know, um, uh, okay. we need to... Okay, yes. all right. Okay, yeah. give me a minute. Okay, um, Akif, Kaira, Akif, Haura, and Fikran, are you ready? Yes. yes. Okay. So we just skip uh, Kaira's part, okay? All right. So I share the screen for you. Okay, hand over to you, Akif. Okay. Assalamualaikum and good day, everyone. Most honorable Madam Paranjit Kaur, Principal of Kamla Nehru Public School, India. Respected Mr. Pramod Tube, the founder director of Life Skill Studio, educator and beloved friends. My name is Akif Zamani. I am from Malaysia. 
I feel very proud to be present in the glorious ceremony. First, allow me to introduce SK Batu Balai. Our school is located in countryside. My school, my school name is SK Batu Balai. It is my temple of learning and my favorite place of enjoying. It is beautiful, big and airy. It has a big field where children can play. My school has many trees which give fresh air to start our days with a lot of positive energy. This is my headmaster, Mr. Abdul Wahab Arifin. My headmaster is like a hope for me. The headmaster of my school is very well qualified and talented. He always makes us learn about new things. <coughs> These are our school teacher and staff. The teacher in my school are also very wise and helpful. I love my school because it helped me to grow and become a good citizen. Okay, I will hand over to Fikran. Thank you, Akif. Hi, I'm Fikran Najmi. I would like to introduce all of you to my human happiness team. This is our group, facilitator Madam Sumia Binti Yahya. Let's get it down. She is an English language teacher. Microsoft Innovative Educator 2020. She is Certified Educator 2021. A Workalette Community Member. And has 70 years teacher experience. She always believed that she could change the world. That is why she became a teacher. This is Human Happiness Ambassador of SK Batu Balai. Her name is Afa Khairani Binti Rahimi. She is 11 years old. She trusts that success doesn't come to you. You go to it. Her name is Nur Haura Azahra binti Burhanuddin. She is 11 years old. She trusts that if you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. If you are determined to learn, no one can stop you. This name is Akif Zamani bin Salehuddin. He is 12 years old. He trusts that there is no elevator to success. You have to take the steps. Her name is Nodaya Amani Benki Amran. She is 11 years old. She trusts that if you cannot do great things, do small things a great way. Her name is Chitno Aizulaika. She, she is 11 years old. She always say, you can have a better tomorrow if you still thinking about yesterday. His name is Muhammad Daniel Hakim Ben Mustafa. He is 11 years old. He trusted that success is the son of small efforts repeated day in and day out. The last one is me. My name is Fikran Nazmi Ben Abdul Rahim. I am 12 years old. I trust that you must do the thing you cannot do. We are proud to be selected as the Human Happiness Ambassador. We will spread happiness around the world. That's all from me. Thank you. Now I will hand over to my friend. Hi. Okay, Kaira. Kaira, are you here, Kaira? Yes. Okay, Kaira, you continue. Hi everyone, I am Alpha Kairani Bentarini. Today I would like to share with you all about my journey. 
throughout the Human Happiness Project. Through this project, me and my friends have been able to learn many new things and have transformed us into great students. In this project, we are given exposure to use some of the latest technology. It is very interesting and facilitates our activities. Among them is that we can learn and practice the use of Kahoot, Flipgrid, Wakelet, PowerPoints, and Minecraft. We also use Zoom and Microsoft Teams to communicate with each other. Now we become a competent user of it. During this project, various interesting programs were presented. Among the ones we enjoy the most are Global Connections. During Global Connection, various interesting were presented once we enjoy the most our global connection, we will given the opportunity to travel virtually to several countries, but we also gain knowledge and share, share experience and meet great people around the world. These are few countries that we have visited together. This, have, this helps us to learn more about our country and the world. That's all from me. I hand over to you, Haura. Hi, I'm Haura Azahra. I would like to share an experience of what I have been through. I'm so proud to be able to study with great teachers in this project. In addition, I'm also very lucky to be given the opportunity to be a presenter in several foreign health. This makes me a more courageous and confident person. This learning experience has improved my critical thinking skills, problem solving, and decision making. Last week, for the first time, I was able to celebrate World Earth Day with friends from all over the world. I'm also very opportunistic to be a presenter at the event. The world is so beautiful when shared together. Through this project, many valuable things have been acquired. So me and my friends always be with other who make you smile, hold on to your values, accept the good, imagine the best, do things you love, find purpose, listen to your heart, trust your push yourself, not other, and be open to change. As conclusion, we are proud to be the human happiness ambassador and will continue to spreading happiness. We are ready to become a future global citizen who will seek to achieve SDG and will be competent in terms of life skills. That's all from me. Back to you, Aki. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Thank you, Haira, Fikra, and Haura. Before we end our presentation, special thank Mr. Premier Tube. It has been sheer pleasure and blessing to be in this project. You have enlightened, enriched, inspired us in many ways on 
behalf of SK Batu Balai. I extend my gratitude. Thank you. Thank you so much, dear students of SK Batu Balai and our happiness facilitator from Malaysia for this wonderful presentation. Moving ahead with further, we have educator Corina Sujdeya, ma'am, from Romania. I request ma'am to proceed with her presentation. Hello, good afternoon. Uh, it's a happy moment to be here. I will present today something. I hope you will like it. It's a short story about happiness. And uh, of course, everything starts with human happiness. I am Corina Sujda, happiness facilitator from Romania. And uh, the story began how? Very simple. All you need is involvement, desire, and openness. And everything was possible and is possible with human happiness. A wonderful uh, connection with the global pulse, with the teachers and students from different countries, make me find happiness. And you may see some uh, pictures from our connections. Our happiness uh, journey. was really, really very, very nice and happy moment with students and teachers from different countries. But uh, do you know what happiness is? Next, I will tell you a story that will uh, surely make you understand what happiness means. Four hormones which de determine a ha a human happiness. As I sat in the park after my morning walk, my wife came and stood next to me. She had completed her 30 minutes jog. We chatted for a while. She said she is not happy in life. I looked up at her. She uh, disabled since seemed to have the best of everything in life. Why do you think so? I don't know. Everyone tells I have everything need but uh, I am not happy. Then I uh, questioned myself, am I happy? Was my inner voice reply. No, that was an eye opener for me. I began my quest to understand the real cause of my unhappiness. I couldn't, uh, couldn't find one. I dug deeper read articles, spoke to life coaches, but nothing made sense. At last, my doctor friend gave me the answer which put all my questions and doubts to rest. I implemented those and uh, will say I am a lot happier person. She said there are four hormones which d determine a human happiness, endorphins, dopamine, serotonin, and oxytocin. It is important we understand these hormones as we need all four of them to stay happy. Let's have a look at the first hormone, the endorphin. When we exercise, the body releases endorphin. This hormone helps the body cope with the pain of exercising. We then enjoy exercising because these endorphins will make us happy. Lotter is a, another uh, good way of uh, generating endorphin. We need to spend 30 minutes exercising every day, read or watch funny st stuff to get our day's dose of endorphin. The second hormone is uh, dopamine. In our journey of life, we accomplish many little and big tasks. It releases uh, various levels of uh, dopamine. When we get appreciated for our work at the office or at home, we feel accompli uh, accomplished and good. 
that is uh, because it releases dopamine. This also explains why most housewives are unhappy since they uh, rarely get uh, knowledged and appreciated for their work. Ons join work, car, a house, the la uh, latest uh, gadgets, a new house, so forth. Uh, Corina, Corina, sorry to interrupt you. Your slides are not moving. It's frozen. My, sorry. The slide is frozen. We are on, uh, you know, finding happiness. The same slide is there for last uh, through two three minutes. Why? But uh, I have the the proper slide here. <coughs> I yes, will stop also... sharing and and um, try again. Please share that. And session four uh, starts in a few hours, yes? Uh, do you see now my... Yes, 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 we can. See, we can. The second uh, hormone, dopamine? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So now, do we realize why we become happy when we stop? The third hormone, serotonin, is release, released when we act in a way that benefits others. When we transcend ourselves and give back to others or to nature or to the society, it releases serotonin. Even providing useful information on the internet, like writing information, blogs, answering people's questions, and the Quora or Facebook groups will generate serotonin. That is because we will use our precious time to help other people via our uh, answers or articles. The final hormone is oxytocin. It is released when we become close to other human beings. When we hug our friends or uh, family, oxytocin is uh, released. The Jado Kai Japi from uh, Man Manabai, Muna Munabai does really works. Similarly, when we share hands or put our arms around someone's shoulders, various amounts of oxytocin is released. So it is simple. We have to exercise every day to get endorphins. We have to accomplish uh, little goals and get dopamine. We need to be nice to others to get serotonin. Finally, hug our kids, friends, and families to get oxytocin, and we will be happy. When we are happy, we can deal with our challenges and problems better. No, we can understand why we need to hug a child who has a bad mood. So, in order to feel more and more happy day by day, motivate ourselves to play and have some fun, some fun, endorphins, appreciate others for any small or big achievements, dopamine, 